The leasehold system has left some householders in unsellable and unmortgageable homes, a committee of MPs has found. They said leaseholders in new-built properties were often treated as a source of profit. While a leaseholder owns the right to use a property for a fixed period of time, it's the freeholder who owns the property outright and the land on which it's built. They also decide what service charges are payable and they can ask for necessary work to be carried out to make sure the property is kept up. The Labour chair of the Housing Committee, Clive Betts, told the Commons this was a very complicated area of law, but he had a very simple suggestion. Let's, in the end, recognise the changes that need to happen, but also recognise there will be enormous benefit in the long term for everyone if we had a wider review of the whole legislation around leasehold, give the Law Commission the funds to do it, do it uh, and that the Government again has really backed off that proposal. Uh, at least agree that, Minister, today, because that's a very simple suggestion, but one in the end which could have enormous long-term benefits. The Housing Minister, Heather Wheeler, pledged the Government would create a market that was fair, simple and transparent. There are over 4 million leasehold properties in the UK uh, and leasehold tenure allows people to complete the journey towards ownership. As many members will know, the committee's report contained a number of recommendations concerning both existing and future leaseholders. The Government has welcomed, considered and responded to these recommendations and we will now press ahead with our programme of reform. The Housing Minister, Heather Wheeler.